Hello. I was sat here working on the pocket slobbits and putting their eyes and noses in and I thought they look so cute. I have to do a little film of them because I'm finally happy with how the faces look, the noses and the eyes and the fact that they're coming out quite different to each other by just doing a big nose or a little nose. So these pocket slobbits are the sloth and rabbit combination of the big ones but they have, um, you can actually put your hands on the inside, uh, your fingers on the inside in the ears and the hands if you had little hands. But for me, I work them like this. And it's quite sweet actually, because you can have them sitting in your hand as quite an intimate relationship with your puppet, as well as for other people to see. So that one's a bit more sloth-like. And then if you look at this one, I think it's a bit more rabbity, just by the thinner fur and the little nose. So you can see the difference between those two. Um, I've got a few here I've just been working on. There's another one with a smaller nose and the ears going, tucking down a little bit more. Uh, I could show you all of them, but this would be a very long video. Let me see, that one's a little bit tighter on me around the bottom, but it's still very comfortable to wear. You can't really see his face in this light, but he is cute. So, um, instead of these going into the boxes as we had before, these are going into little bags because they're perfect for working with a group of children or young people and also for gifts. So Lucy's done me a sticker. It says sleeping slob it inside. Shush. And then this bag is a bit of a brighter coloured one. And for children, you have the pocket slob it handbook full of activities and things to do and write into the book games to play with your slobbit and you get stickers in there as well there's a plain colored bag hoping to have some choice oh and for the older young people and for adults the be more slobbit journal and you get postcards and stickers too and this is where there's a little bit of slobbit philosophy there i guess you could call it or actions and things to do to keep balanced in life but plenty of room to write in as well and the paper is Good quality, so it's nice to write in. So these will be, it will be with the plush pocket slobbit and the book or the handbook will be in the Etsy shop soon, as soon as I've got them photographed and popped on there. But these are also for groups. So if you work with a group of young people or children, or even for adults, then please let me know. And I'm very happy to talk to you about giving you some of these cute little chaps. What, which one am I gonna finish with? Oh, there's too many. Oh, this one. Look, it's cute. So for me and the Slobbits, we'll say goodbye for now. And uh, thank you for listening.